to get the hole, you have to go... Okay, this is gonna be sketchy, isn't it? Hi friend, I am HBG, and welcome to Subnautica. In today's episode, we're going to be starting a brand new game, and we're going to see how long it actually takes to get the Cyclops. We'll be doing it in survival mode, not hardcore mode, just because if I die, I don't want to restart. But we're going to go through like the stuff we kind of need to begin with to actually get this. We're going to skip this whole start screen, because I'm sure you've all seen it. We'll skip that bad boy. And here we are. So, I think we'll need to start with a knife, a repair tool, to get this thing all fixed up, and the scanner. For sure, we'll need that stuff, and if you want choice-wise, you can get the air bladder. I think the air bladder is huge, especially starting a game like this, because you need oxygen. And that's the best way to get up to the surface when you don't, when you can't move fast, you know what I mean? So let's get some of that stuff going. Zero human life signs detected. Sucks to suck, at least we survived. Alright, so we're gonna try and find some fishies. See, with the air body, you can just go straight up. You have to swim super slow. Get it going. Where are the bladder fish? Alright, whatever. Let's grab these two things real quick. This should all get us, this should get us most of the basics besides, besides the repair tool. Because we're gonna need one of the crash fish. Which those are easy to find, they just kind of mess you up. So here we go. Okay, so I think we have the majority of stuff we need for the basics. Let's pop in here real quick. I'm not going to build a base or anything either. We're just going to go straight from this area, see how long it takes. I will be doing some cuts and stuff like that, because I don't want you guys to sit through the whole thing, as you can tell. But, once I actually get everything built, I'll show you the timestamp on the game, the new save that we did. Alright, so here we go. We're going to start with air bladder. Thank you. I think this is huge, personally. I really do. Let's get you moved to five, because that's what I'm used to. And then let's get the knife built. Oh, okay. O2 tank also, guys. I mean, that is kind of big. Don't have to have it, but I'd say get it. Makes life a little bit easier. There we go. Weapons were removed All right. from standard survival blueprints following the Beautiful. massacre Beautiful. on Abraxas Prime. The knife remains the only exception. I'm personally curious what happened on Obraxis Prime. I really am. If anybody knows, please let me know in the comments. Okay, so so far I think we have most of the basics. We need the scanner, which means we need at least two batteries. One for the scanner, one for the repair tool. So let's go ahead and knock that stuff out. And I will see you back here in a second. Okay, guys, so we found enough for two batteries, which should be good for now. Let's see, let's get up here real quick. Kind of take a look at what all we need... Oh, crap. I need the stupid Ashton mushrooms. I always forget about that. That's the worst thing. At least they're all around here. That's the one good thing about those little mushy rooms. Let's grab four of them. We'll get two batteries made. So we will get the scanner built, and we still need the crash, crash stuff for the tool. Let's go ahead and pull it up real quick. Just so we have it. Repair tool. Cave sulfur. That's what it is. Which, I mean, it's easy to get, but sometimes the Quite explosive. <laughs> Just kidding, let's get the battery made. We'll get the scanner made. We have enough for that. At least, there's that. Nice. Get these made up. Oh, a power cell. Nice. Well, I don't think we'll need that right now. We probably will for the actual... Let's see. The actual uh, Cyclops itself, but we'll cross that bridge once it gets here. All right, so we have this thing. The scanner can be used to synthesize blueprints what? from salvage technology and That's to record alien biological crazy. data. Let's come down here. Maybe we'll get lucky and find a. a oh well, look at that. Who knew? I'm gonna grab you. Yeah, 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 buddy. It's gonna get me. Yeah, every time, every freaking time. Please have it. Nice. And there we go. And there's the repair tool. Let's get this thing up and running real quick. I mean, that's actually pretty easy. That makes me happy. Oh, son of a B-word. We need more of the damn... Oh, no, we're good. We're good. Look at that. We still got the clusters. So it might be smart to get multiple clusters when you go over there to do it. I'm not always thinking ahead. But this time I did, which is nice. Let's do that. And you know what? Let's go ahead and do one lubricant, because we're going to need that later, too. 
I'm pretty sure for the Cyclops. In construction of vehicles and power plants. Cool. Here we go. Nice. Okay, this is good. This is good. All right, so we got that built. Let's come out here real quick. Oh, what am I doing? Okay, so we got that built. Here we go. Let's get everything fixed up real quick. That's why we got this stuff. Nice, dude. Okay. Actually going pretty good. Not gonna lie. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, there we go. Nice, dude. Running full environment diagnostic that going. Resorts to data bank. Get this going. We don't really need this, honestly. So you don't you don't have to do this to get what we're trying to do. Nice, man. So let's see here. What else am I thinking we'll need? So we got this stuff, which is basically all the basic stuff that you need. The knife repair tool scanner and slash or bladder. Sweet. So let's go look for some... Um, Blueprints, man. We are going to need, let's see here, the Sea Glide and the Mobile Vehicle Bay. Those are the two beginning things that we're going to need. And hopefully, they're not too much of a disaster to find. A lot of times, you'll find stuff over here around the creep vines, but we shall see. Let's drop this for now. And as I find each thing, I will let you guys know and kind of give you a time frame of how long that took, which I mean, it's kind of straightforward. Either find the blueprints or don't. I think this will be the longest part of actually getting the build done. I really do, finding these stupid blueprints. Alright, and here we go. Alright guys, one other thing that you might want to get, you don't have to have it. You don't have to have it, but I would suggest getting some fins. And look, I just grabbed some uh, of these. So let's get this going. We'll get some fins on. Help you swim a little bit quicker. I didn't even think about it until a second ago. There we go, and let's get that stupid repair thing off of the my, uh... The draws from available data to provide environment-appropriate equipment using locally available materials. There we For go. For safety, this setting cannot be overridden. No, oh, thanks. Alright, guys, I'm gonna go <laughs> try and find some more blueprints, and I'll see you again here in a second. Okay, guys, this is why I always suggest that you guys get the, uh, air bladder, because you can explore. Oxygen. You have that kind of stuff, and just so I can pop that thing. You don't have to swim up. Just let nature take course. But that's why I suggest getting it. You don't have to, like I said, you do not have to whatsoever for this, but I suggest you can stay down a little bit longer and do what you need. And just an FYI, the sun's down. It's taking me friggin' forever to find any blueprints because I can't see. So I'm gonna try and get a battery made, I think, to make a flashlight. Again, you don't need that, but it might make our lives a little bit easier. Oh, wait, is, what is this? What is this? Come on. Come on, what is that? Nice, dude. Okay. One of two. Nice, okay. Okay, so you're saying there's a chance. <laughs> All right, guys. Once you find the next one, I'll let you know. Oh, wait. What is it right here? Nope. Is this it? Here we go. This is it, guys. Because it didn't take that long, did it? And, <laughs> yeah. Nice, dude. So I guess we don't need that friggin' flashlight. Let's get up here and see what we need for that sea glide. Alright, come on, dude. And I'm honestly not sure where we're at right now when it comes to time-wise, which I'm not gonna worry about. Not until we are completely done with this. Let's go ahead and come in here. See what this needs. Oh, dude, that's kinda easy, not gonna lie. Uh, let's get you guys made. Let's see. So we're going to need at least three copper. That'll be the hardest part, I think. When I say hardest, the most tedious, because copper sometimes is the pain in the ass to find. So let's see how much we have right now. I think it's just one. Yeah, we just have one. Which is okay. Let's drop this stuff off. Let's find some more copper. And, yeah. Once I find the copper, we'll be back. Alright, guys. So it didn't take me very long, and I actually found... The two copper that I needed. I just dove straight down. That makes me happy. All right, so we already got this sea glide going, man. That is good. Holy crap, this is going very, very smooth, honestly. Wasn't expecting to go this smooth. If you guys want me to do this again without any cuts, let me know. But for now, uh, there it is. Okay. For now, we're going to do some cuts because I don't want it to take a full two hours, however long it's going to take me to do this. There we go. Nice. Will All right. Your effective exploration range. For your safety, please pack supplies for long journeys. No. And stay within five kilometers of the nearest life pod or habitat. 
That sounds dumb. So, we have found one of the mobile vehicle bases. We're going to need that. But we honestly don't need it, need it yet. To be completely fair, I'm not going to scan that. We don't need that. That is right there. That's freaking awesome. I love that. Anything here? No. So, I'm going to do some exploration for the rest. I say the rest. For the actual Cyclops blueprints. And for that, let's come up here real quick. Let's see where we're at before we march off and die. The sun just came up. I'm going to go behind the Aurora. Yes, it's dangerous. But you'll find a lot of pieces back there for the Cyclops. All right, guys, so I'm going to swim over there, and I'll meet you once I get more towards the edge, right? Okay, guys, so we kind of did, like, a little side quest. But if you come in here, you can find a lot of blueprints also. So we have a biofuel reactor right here. Let's see, let's see. I thought that was something else, not going to lie. But we need one more for the actual, uh, uh, what you call it, Seamoth also. So you can probably get all of this plus the Cyclops in a decent amount of time, man. Doesn't take long at all. Let's see, and a scanner room. Let's see how long that takes. Two or three. So you can probably find most of this stuff. Alright, let's me let's me uh let me come up here real quick. And we'll see. It's fine. See, this is why you got this. This is why you got this thing. Exactly why you got this thing. It's kind of a side quest, guys. Sorry. There it is. Come down here and get this. And you already have. The Seamoth also, dude. It's actually really good. Really good. Stay out of here, Stan Shark. Yeah, here. You're fine, you're fine, you're fine. You're fine. There we go. So what, we got the Seamoth also. Good little side quest done. Quest done and got. Nice, man. Okay. So now let's head over to behind the Aurora like I was doing. So yeah, if you come to this biome, you'll find all the pieces for the Seamoth. Just so you know. Alright guys, we are here, and this is where you're going to find a lot of parts for the Cyclops. I'm not sure if you can find everything the here. Day's water ration ahead of time will help ensure against dehydration and it's eventual fine. death. It's fine, it's fine. There's a bridge right there. You can find a lot of parts down here, just so you guys know. Let's look around for the Reaper. That's the biggest thing. When you come down here, there's the Reaper. The biggest thing you gotta watch out for. Bridge, oh, and radiation. But I mean, it's a little bit of health, that's fine. We're kinda doing a speed run anyways. Not speed run, but. There we go, there's that, there's that. I know you can find the engine parts here also. Oh, shit. I hear you, buddy. Okay, let's go up. While he's charging us. There we go. Okay, where you at, big guy? He's down there still. Okay, we're doing fine. So we got two of the whole fragments already. Here's an engine part. Let's get that big guy. I think I saw what I wanted to see down here also. Nice, 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 because we still need this. This is two of three. All right, this is going to be the hardest part, honestly, is getting the stuff for the Cyclops. Here's another engine part. Okay, so I think we can get the hole and the engine behind here. And to me, it's the fastest way. Okay, and he's charging. Oh, he got me. Yep, 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 we gotta retreat. We gotta fall back a little bit, just a little bit. What's our health looking like? I don't think I have any health kits on me either. I do not. Dang. That's the true question. Do we go back for a health kit? How far is it? 440. Yeah, I'm gonna go back for a health kit, guys. It's gonna kinda cut down on our time. It's gonna cut our time up, I should say, not cut down. I could be a dumb dumb and just not do it. Let's go ahead and go like this. Let's go like this. We can make more medkits instead of waiting for that thing to make it. So we'll do that. I should have brought it with me to begin with. That'll cut down time, so maybe bring medkits if you're doing this. We'll go back and I'll meet you back over there. Just a little reminder, guys, if you stay at zero meters and you're using your uh sea glide, you don't lose O2, and you can still use your sea glide. So if you go to one meter, you lose oxygen. If you stay at zero and go, you're fine. Good to go. All right, where are we at? We're almost back. All right, we'll see you in a second, guys. Okay, we're back, guys. There's the Reaper. All right. 
So I made it. I made a little video before that said, "Don't fear the Reaper." Honestly, don't fear him. Yeah, he's a big guy. Can be mean, but you can dodge him. Pretty easy. Honestly, not to toot my own horn or anything. All right, so we are down here. Plenty of boxes. And if you never knew, there's a ton of scrap back here also. So you can find a ton of stuff. All right, got some batteries, and here's one more. Come on, bridge, bridge, bridge. There's the bridge. All right, so do we just need the engine? Or do we need the hole? Acquired. I'm not sure if you can find the hole back here. There's that. It's fine. So that was the bridge. We need one more engine. Let's go up. I thought I saw the freaking Reaper going at me. We're good. What is down here? What's this one? What's this one? Engine. Nice. So this will be the engine. Nice. Okay. Got the engine. I don't think we can find the hole here. Let's grab some more of this stuff. At least while we're here. Uh, what's that one? What's that one? I don't think it's going to be... Bridge. Nope. Yeah, I don't think we can find the hole here, guys. I really don't. That's what... <laughs> never mind. I was going to say something inappropriate. Passing we'll keep it inappropriate. Meters. We'll keep it appropriate. Oxygen Excuse efficiency me. decreased. I'm going to grab this stuff. I really don't think you can find the hole back here. But I know where to find it. And I will show you guys that also. Here in a second. I'm going to do a little bit more exploring. So as you can see, we're in the... Oh shit! Yep. All right. See, that's you gotta be careful about that. Don't fear the reaper, I said. All right, that's fine. At least we know that he doesn't one shot us while we're here. Could have definitely been worse. Leave me alone, big guy. Where's he? At? He's over there. Okay. He got us. He's gonna leave us alone for a little bit. Ooh, that scared me a little bit. Not gonna lie. Kind of got the blood pumping. Yeah, we're not gonna find. Let's go and grab some more of this stuff. All right, let's head back to our life pot over there. So you can find pretty much the fragments and the hole. Well, yeah, you can find some stuff here, but not all of it. To get the hole, you have to go... Okay, this is going to be sketchy, isn't it? Where'd you go? Where'd you go? It's fine, big guy. So you can find the bridge, and what was the other one? You can find the other one here, but you can't find the hole here. Uh, the engine and the bridge you can find here. But you can't find the hole, which is fine. Which is fine. I will show you where to go to actually get the hole parts. Maybe. <laughs> so we still have to find the rest of, which it might be right here. Are we going to get lucky? No, we are not, but we will take that, actually. It's point potion cannon, excuse me. Nice, we got that. Okay. But yeah, we still need to finish the um, mobile vehicle bay. Alright, guys, here is the last part of the mobile vehicle bay. Alright. Crazy how that bios. works. Further study recommended. So, this area you can find a lot of stuff when it comes to your sea glide and the mobile vehicle bay. Awesome, man. So now the only part that we need, that we need, need is the, uh, the hole for the, the Cyclops. So that's going to be the next thing on our list. Let's go ahead and use this real quick. Oh, wow. We're full up. I'm going to break that stuff down and we'll go and I'll show you where to find the hole. Okay, guys. So the sun is down, but I'm not trying to waste too much time. Okay. Hey, big guy. Whoa. Brand new does. So we're gonna head this way. About, I think, roughly this way. If you go this way, you will hit the uh, mushroom forest. The, yeah, I think it's the mushroom forest. So we'll go that way, and once we get there, I'll kind of show you. You don't need the sign, the the compass. You just go that way, and you will hit it. And we'll. That's where we're gonna find the hole for the cyclops. Hopefully, we'll find out. Hopefully, that guy doesn't blow up. Because if it does, we're going to be getting a lot of radiation. And that is not good. We're trying to get this before the radiation hits us. Just to kind of show that we can get the Cyclops. I, I, was, I wasn't sure. But we can get the Cyclops before the radiation really starts hitting us. I think. 
Let's keep going this way. Let's keep going this way. Yeah, I think the forest should be right down here, honestly. I'm gonna have to go up for some oxygen at least once. Let's see, let's see. It's not that far away. It really isn't. Come on, big guy. Come on. I think it's right down here. Got a bunch of wreckage. Yeah, it's right here. It should be right here. Let's go up and get some oxygen real quick. Oh, son of a bitch. Sorry, guys. There we go. I hear ya. I hear ya. There we go. Alright, going down. Yep, right here should be the mushroom forest. Somewhere in this area. I think over here. Yes, looks like it anyways. And nice. Yeah, this is where we're going to find the whole fragment. Passing 100 meters. Oxygen efficiency decreased. It'll be rough because... Oh, there's one right there. There's one right there. I think we'll need three. There we go. Yeah, we need three. So I'm going to do my... Uh oh Oh, radiation. Dang, you already got radiation there. 30 seconds. Crap. You might have to wait for it to deton detonate, man. I really think you might have to. That sucks. Unless you go straight in and fix it. Just so you guys know, the air bladder works for about... I'm trying to think. About 180 meters underwater. You should be okay. But I don't know. So if we're going to do this, we're going to have to go back and get a bunch of med kits. So we can actually venture out there a little bit. Or... Build the sea moth. I mean, I didn't think we'd have this issue, to be honest. I really didn't. Uh, let's see what it looks like this way if we're still hitting that. Oh, no, wait. Here's one more. Here's another one. Here's another one. Maybe we'll get lucky. That's a moon pool. Damn it. That's still cool. Still cool. One of two. What is this? What is this one? Moon pool. Might as well finish it off, right? Might as well. So we can get the moon pool already down here too. Let's go up. Uh, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. We're good. Just so you know how this thing actually works and why I always recommend you get it. Oh, right before. So there you go. You can go back and see what that depth was and that's where it ends. <laughs> Suck it up, dude. I saw a piece down here. I'm not sure if that was a fragment for... Ooh, what is that? That's some kind of fragment. We're gonna friggin' scan it. That's one. I think that's Moonpool right there. Let's turn that off. We don't need it. Yeah, it's Moonpool. Okay, come here. Come here. Come on. What do we got here? More Moonpool. Dang. So you can find a lot of Moonpool stuff here. Just be careful in here because you're gonna have a lot of these things if you're trying to use your air bladder to go up. All right, guys. I'm gonna continue the search for that, and I'll let you know when I find them. Come on, baby. What are we at? What are we at? Two? Is this two? All right, there's two. There's two. Nice. Okay. We found two of them. One more, baby. One more. Okay, guys. I think we found everything that we need. This should be it. Yes. Cyclops hole. There we go. Look at that, man. So that's everything we need for the Cyclops. All right, let's go and grab some stuff here. I'm not sure exactly what we're going to need for this. And we need to go back up. <laughs> Once we get up, we'll go ahead and mark what we need for the Cyclops. We are really close to the Gun Island, just so you guys know. Just kind of a heads up of where that's at. Okay, get up there, get up there. There we go, friend. See? We are right there next to it. Okay, so let's get back a little bit before something decides to eat us or kill us. Whatever. Alright, there we go, there we go. So let's go into here. Go to this blueprints. So what do we need for... We need to mark this, which is easy, and we need to mark that. It's actually not that. I think finding... Okay, so while we're here, we will pick up the lithium. And I think finding the teeth is going to be the hardest part. It really is. Okay. So I'm going to find some uh, lithium, which is... If you're in the this area already, you're going to find plenty of it. Honestly, you'll find plenty of it. So let's get to it. And this is why you get the air bladder, guys. 
<laughs> Holy crap. Okay, we're heading back now. I think we have what we need for all this stuff, but we'll find out once we get back there, guys. We will find out. Okay, guys, so I kind of have a basic understanding over there of what we're going to need for all this stuff. And honestly, out of all of it, I think the stalker teeth are going to be the hardest because we need three of the emerald glass. See, honestly, I think the stalker teeth are going to be the hardest. It's going to be... So the search will continue, guys. And I'm going to build this all the way through just so you kind of know how long it took me. And like I said, I'm by no means an expert at this game. I'm decent. I play a lot. Doesn't make me an expert, man. I play a lot of games, but I'm a master of none of them. All right, so I'm sure people can do it much faster than me, but that's fine. So here we go, and let's try and finish this, man. I'm pretty sure it's been under an hour so far. That's the sound I'm looking for. I want to find that guy. So if you guys don't know how to find stalker teeth, you find these guys, and if they have scrap in their mouth, they'll drop teeth. There's a certain percentage chance that they'll drop teeth. That's kind of what you're waiting for. I'm not sure how hard it is it's the beginning of the game. But I don't know. We'll find out. We'll find out. Just so you guys know, if you didn't know already, if you have a peeper, your buddy here will come eat from your hand. If he's up for it. There we go. Yeah, see? And he's your friend for a little bit. It's kind of a fun little side quest once again. Come on, man. Grab the stuff and drop a tooth. There's one. There's one, guys. Nice. So we got one. Okay, so this is going to be the hardest part. You have to wait for him to actually do stuff. Which is awesome, dude. Okay, nice. He's actually active. Let's kind of hang out by this guy for a minute. Oh, nice. Even better. Come on, keep dropping teeth. Keep. Oh, there's one. There's one more. Oh, okay, and there's one more. There's three teeth. Actually, that was awesome, dude. Perfect. Okay, so we have the three teeth. That means we can get the plasteel. Nice, man. Okay, let's go ahead and grab this, too, because we can. Silver. I'll take it. I'll freaking take it, dude. That was awesome. So how much space do we have on us? More than enough. More than enough. Where's our thing at? Right over here. I'm looking for you, fellas. We need, what, two of these? All right, there we go. Because right now, it's not showing that we can make the advanced wiring kit, but I think it's because... You're fine. I think it's because we have to get uh, the chip made first. It's going to go like that. Let's see if my theory is correct. We don't have... No, we need copper wire. Here we go. All right, we got the chip going. Yes, there it is. Okay, so you have to make the chip first to get the advanced wiring kit, which we actually have. Look at that, dude. Nice, we can get rid of the advanced wiring kit also. This stuff should be kind of straightforward. Because that's two, oh, two lithium per. I'm going to have to go back for quite a bit more lithium, dude. Damn, that sucks. I should have, I should have checked before I came back. Dang, man. That's okay. That's okay. Let's get everything else built. So we already have that. Let's see. Pull this out. We don't have one on us. On us. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. Let's at least get the glass. We're going to need for this. We're going to need... Whatever. Let's get rid of... We don't need you here. We don't need the power cell here. So I'm pretty sure we already did the power cell, right? Yeah, we already have power cell. And that's for that up there okay so we're gonna need two oils dang man that sucks we're gonna have to go back for quite a bit of lithium could be worse all right we'll be back in a second okay so we at least have enough for mobile vehicle base so let's get this up and rolling just so it's down we can get that checked off the box come on come on make it make it there we go we'll just drop it right freaking here how about that? Nice. Okay, so now it's just the grind for finding all the rest of the stuff, man. Which honestly is not that hard. Could be worse. Let's see how much titanium we have. See if we can get all of the ingots made for what we need. One. Come on, come on. Oh, wow. 
We're gonna need a lot more titanium then. I built one of these out here, just so you guys know. Oh, and that just blew up. Crap. That's gonna put a damper on us. Emergency. The quantum detonation has occurred in the Aurora's drive core. The reactor will reach a supercritical state. Into here we go. Ten, of course. Nine, eight, seven, uh, we almost six, had it before the thing blew five, up. Four, three, two. Boom. First hour of the game. So I think it's been about an hour. So we're not doing terribly, terribly bad, dude. Honestly. Let's see. Now that happened, let's go ahead and get this thing made. Man, we need more more lead. That's fine. That's fine. How much mesh mean to that's easy. Just go chop two of these bad boys. Man, this is taking a little bit longer than I was hoping. Like I said, I'm, I'm no expert, so. Inventory is freaking full. Of course it is. Come on. All right, we'll get this thing taken care of. We'll be back in a second. New blueprint acquired. Okay, guys. So I found quite a bit of stuff. Let's see what we need after we get all this made. All right. So we have two of those. Let's go ahead and get you. And you, we're gonna need one more of that. Let's get glass made real quick. Okay, I think this will take care of the enameled glass. Let's see, we'll find out, we'll find out. There we go, there we go. Take care of you. You. Okay, so we're doing awesome. Honestly, all we need is one more plasteel ingot. Let's see what we have real quick in our Trusty one, two, four, six, seven. Damn, so we have seven stuff here. Let's come out here real quick. Maybe we're hit lucky? Yes. Nice, okay, so all we need is the freaking lead. It really is, that's all we need is the lead. Let's get that made. And I think we need, what, two more? Yeah, we need two more lead, which is easy. But frustrating, because I didn't need the lead until I had to make that stupid suit. Okay, dude, awesome, man. So we got that. Then we got that. Holy crap, we almost have it, dude. We are almost there. Let's find some freaking lead. This is probably going to take me ages, watch. Let's see where we're at. We are right here. Let's go this way. I think we should be able to find some lead in this area pretty easy. Kind of the deeper you go, the better it is. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Not you, not you. We're not looking for those. Not right now. Let's see. We want somewhere that goes a little bit, a little bit lower in this area. This area looks freaking perfect. Come on, baby. Come on, come on. This is it. Got those over there. Don't need those. Come on. Come on. Oh, you show me. Show me something decent. Look for these little guys. Okay, that's what we're looking for. We're looking for these guys. These things have lead sometimes. There's one. Dude, that was pretty lucky. Come on. Get lucky again. I don't think we're going to. Let's come this way. Ooh, what about that one? That is not what we're looking for. Dang. I was hoping to find it before we got some uh, oxygen. All right, let's go up. Oh, there we go. And this is why I always bring the, the air bladder, man. This is exactly why. It's fine, it's fine. There we go. Alright, let's finish this. I see one more of those. One more lead, man. Come on. Here we go. Here we go. That's it, man. That's everything. Alright, let's go back and make this thing. Holy crap. Actually, that was pretty quick. I'm not gonna lie. For me personally, that was fast. Like I said, I'm by no means an expert. Let's go to our, our zero meter mark. So we're not using O2, but we're still using this thing. Holy crap, man. All right, let's get it made. Let's see what this time is. Come on, come on. Hurry up, hurry up. There it is. That's what I'm talking about right there. That's what I'm talking about. Right freaking here. Come on. And here we go. Let's see. Boom. 
must be constructed in deep the water. Are you serious? Come on, man. How are we looking? <laughs> Come on, dude. Don't climb. Don't climb. All right. Who knew that this was going to be the worst part? There we go. Shit. All right. I guess we'll come this way. Dang, seriously? I guess that's that, that saying, don't count your eggs before they're hatched. Let's come this way. How about right over here? We'll get it made. So yeah. Let's go right <laughs> freaking here. <laughs> I didn't think this would be a thing. I really didn't. There we go. Float a little bit slower, please. A little bit slower. And... There it is. Let's try this again, shall we? Come on, come on, come on. There it is. It's designed to be operated by a three-person crew. Only experienced Helms people should attempt to pilot this vehicle solo. Well, this thing is in trouble, because I am not experienced whatsoever. Nice, man. Okay. So let's go ahead and let this thing hit the water. And we will check what time it took. Uh, while we're at, oh, okay, do you know what? Screw it. Three, drop it, whatever. Let's come check. Let's come check. I was gonna go get that Cyclops thing off of us, but. Welcome aboard, Captain. Nice. All right, online. here we are, guys. Our Cyclops. Let's save it real quick. Well, quick game. Let's see what it is, all right? How long did it take? All right, um, play. And it took one hour and 10 minutes, guys. One hour, 10 minutes. So if you want the Cyclops, that's all it takes. One hour, 10 minutes. All right. Awesome, man. That's actually not bad. Not bad at all. So, from this point, I'm actually going to do a little playthrough of just using the Cyclops as my main base. So we're going to try, we're going to beat the game with just the Cyclops. I know it's been done. I think here quite recently, actually, but I've been thinking about doing it for a while. So we're going to go ahead and do it. I might make a uh, prawn suit, but we'll see. Maybe we'll just stick with this thing. But yeah, guys, one hour, ten minutes, not bad. Um, if you guys want to tell me how fast you can do it, please, by all means, leave it in the comments how fast you did it. And I'm looking forward to hearing your stories, all right? With that being said, this is going to be our new base, and this will be a new series. It's going to be our surviving in the Cyclops series. That's going to be it. Let's run back here real quick, take a look at what we actually need for the next series. Efficiency, you. So it's an upgrade. All right, so we still need a lot of stuff to get this stuff going. So we're going to need a lot of batteries, honestly. But hey, that's fine. That's fine, guys. All right, with that being said, if you guys enjoyed this episode, give it a like. If you enjoyed me, subscribe. Uh, thank you if you made it this far for watching. And yeah, like I said, let me know how long it takes you to build your Cyclops. All right? Try it out. See how long it takes. <laughs> Take care, guys. And I will see you next time.